Hi, it's Dr. Caspers at Caspers Chiropractic Center giving you another health tip that I want you to pay attention to. And today we're talking about standing and what you should do when you have to stand for long periods of time. Um, a lot of people don't realize that when you do have to stand for a long period of time, if you're standing flat-footed like I am right now for any length of time, what happens is the curve that's in the small of my back starts to sway and become excessive. And so when we look at a spine right here, what happens is the spine starts to curve too much or excessively or what we call sway back, and it causes these joints to jam in the back of the spine here, and that causes increased pressure on those nerves. And that can eventually lead to more pain or fatigue within those muscles or eventually lead to an injury to those muscles. And so the tip I want to give you about when you have to stand for any length of time is I want you to focus on putting your foot up on something about six inches, just like I'm doing on this stool right here. Because when I put my foot up on something about six inches, it causes that curve to go into its normal uh, state so that it actually doesn't put that increased pressure in there. And the other tip then is just to make sure that you switch feet every so often back and forth by having that foot up on something about six inches. So if you're working at a workbench, find something to put your foot up on. Let's say you're doing dishes at the kitchen sink, open that cupboard door underneath and put your foot inside that cupboard and get your foot up you know, about four to six inches to help relax that curve in the low spine. And you'll find that you're going to be able to stand a lot longer and much more comfortably and you're going to be able to protect that spine. And so if you have any further questions or if you'd like to become a patient here in our office, please contact us at 320-587-2292 or look us up on the web at www.casperschiropractic.com.